Okay, so for today's lesson, we are looking at the work of Louis Jova. Louis Jova is a Yugoslavian artist who deconstructs the minds of people he believes are great geniuses and looks at what comes out of their mind to create the work that they do. So as you look here, we have Frida Kahlo, whose mind is deconstructed through branches of trees, through letters, through arrows and butterflies and moons. It's a very feminine image. If we look here at Andy Warhol, again, quite feminine. We've got swirls, we've got lines, we've got geometric shapes and arrows. So they're all quite similar. However, he's trying to think about what creates their mind. So pulling apart their brain, taking out their eye and going, this is what explodes from their mind when they are working. He obviously created his work in digital and analog. So these are photocopies of images, um, black and white. And then he has hand drawn or rubber stamped different shapes and words in them. Now we're not going to do it that way because this is your um, workshops on Photoshop. And I believe that this is a good experience of trying to use some different tools today. So we're going to learn how to do a kind of Jova-esque photograph image using Photoshop. So let's have a look at Photoshop. Here's one that I created earlier using stock images and images that I have provided you with. Now, usually, if you did this at home where you would have access to downloading lots of brushes if you owned your own Photoshop, as you can see from my Photoshop at home, I have hundreds and thousands of, I have literally a ridiculous amount of brushes. Unfortunately, you are not allowed to do that in school because we're not allowed to download things to the computers. So what I have done for you is create this folder on Google Drive. If you go to shared with me and you find a folder called Jova, it should be shared with you all. So that's now shared with you. And I've picked out a number of brushes that I have in my collection, some papers, etc., that you might want to use. It's very limited amount. However, you can play around with these as much as you want. There's some paper here as well with different colors on that you can use the marquee tools on to select as well. Some very strange little bits that I have sticking around on my computer. And you have access to all of those. You can either download them all at once or you can download them as you use them. If you want to download everything all at once, remember to go to Jova, download, okay? So I'm going to do that now and download it as a zip file and come back to you later and show you what to do next. So that's the end of part one. Thank you.